this is something that I never thought I would say in a video, but we're gonna talk about porn. More specifically, Pornhub. Now, I mean, I've talked about sex on this channel. I am published in a book about sex. I wrote a, you know, I, I wrote a chapter in a book about sex. By the way, Hannah Witten's doing it, the US version coming out next week, or this week when you're watching this. Go get a copy. And if you have a question about sex that you would like me to answer as a disabled person, a deaf person, you know, chronic pain, chronic fatigue, leave your question down below. I'd like to talk about the subject a little bit more. But for now, let's talk about Pornhub. Ricky, why the hell are you talking about Pornhub? Let's just read the headlines, shall we? Pornhub adds closed captions for the hearing impaired and stenographer fetishist. For the record, hearing impaired is a bit of an outdated term. Deaf works just fine. But that's not the point right now. Pornhub adds closed captions for viewers with hearing loss. Pornhub now offers closed captions. You get the point. Basically, Pornhub, a website that streams porn, stolen porn, a lot of it, is now offering closed captions. So now, if I want to, I finally get to understand the whole plot of the whole, uh, really in front of my salad meme. Let's just, let's just read a bit from some articles right now, shall we? Pornhub may always have one eye on an eye-catching publicity stunt, but it is at least trying to bring adult content to those with accessibility issues. From today, the site is adding closed captions to a section of its content library geared towards those with hearing loss. Over a thousand clips across a number of genres will offer descriptive and interpretive text. What's interpretive text? For those who are not able to hear the video's original audio. Pornhub says the features will help viewers distinguish which person is speaking at any one time and identify changes in emotion, blah, blah, blah. So basically, they're doing what Netflix apparently does not. If you're confused by that, I just did a video on Monday about Netflix not captioning properly, and now this, both of these things occurred in the same week. The Pornhub adding captions occurred after Netflix, so everybody was making jokes about how Pornhub will be accessible but Netflix, well, not. Nah, it, it, it was kind of funny. It was kind of funny. So my thoughts on this, I can't knock it. I mean, it's video content. It has dialogue in it. I mean, when you go on streaming sites like Pornhub and XNXX and, you know, whatever. So when you go on streaming websites like those, they're often, like, stolen content, if you will, at least. You know, I, I, ha I am friends with some webcam girls that are like on my free cams and their content often gets stolen by these websites. So, you know, when when you go to these sites, a lot of what would originally be like a full episode, like a full movie, would be cut down to like just the actual sex part. But, you know, you, you sometimes come across videos that actually have the whole video or, you know, they have the plot and then, you know, some of that, and you know, that's just how it goes. So now you finally get to understand what the pizza delivery guy is saying or the plumber or, you know, some other really bizarre plots that I just don't want to say in this video. So, I mean, why? Not nah, some people thought it was very, very strange, but accessibility is accessibility. So it might seem a little strange at first, but like I said, I can't knock it. I mean, yeah, you might get a lot of stuff that just says asterisk moaning, asterisk, but. Now my only thing is, I don't know if anybody mentioned this in an article, but are they kind of like, are the captions actually provided by Pornhub itself? Or is it like YouTube's community contribution? To which, if it was the latter, I would not be as impressed because YouTube is bad enough with its community contribution and YouTube doesn't allow this sort of thing on the website, or so it says. People that go on Pornhub, however, uh, hmm, not so great. Not always so great. So, mm. so this article says the videos have been hand captioned rather than using an algorithmic system similar to that of other major video platforms. So I'm guessing Pornhub itself has a team that's writing these captions. Huh. Okay. And I mean, hey, Pornhub has apparently already been accessible. I mean, they have been accessible for blind folks. They have videos that have audio descriptions. So, okay. We checked to see if anybody had bothered with the clips and to our surprise, several of them around a million views. Well, yes, I'm sure blind people like to watch porn too. Clearly there's a market and a need for such an offering. So the outfit 
deserves some praise for even trying, not just for other parts of its business. So this is why I was asking if anybody has any questions, leave them. Because yes, disabled people have sex too. Disabled people masturbate. Yeah, they might want to watch porn. So if they want accessible content, I mean, personally, I don't really need the captions. I don't like listening to the stuff because it's cringy to me. So, but others might, those with better hearing than me or the same hearing or, you know, there might be other people that even deafer than me, but frequencies are different, so they might hear some things, you know. Again, deafness is a spectrum. If anybody has tried it out, let me know. I've had some people tell me that this was already a thing and that they researched it for science. I think that's really all that I have to say on the matter. I mean, you know, good job, Pornhub, you beat Netflix and something. I mean, Netflix has been doing it longer, but they dropped the ball on it, so props to you, man. And with that said, by the way, I do have a new shirt campaign, My Accessibility, My Choice, so it kind of goes along with this, I guess. I'll have the shirt link down below if you want to go take a look at that. Uh, sale ends on July 21st. And also, before you go, if you haven't, consider pledging on Patreon. You get perks like exclusive writing content, playlist, and letters depending on what you pick. And I will see you later. Bye.